Cash out Ace, what's good? What's up, what's up? Man, I hear a lot about you, man. A lot, a lot about you, man. Over the past, I'm going to say six to eight months, man, your name been ringing all over, you know, not only the city of Houston, but, you know, the state of Texas, man. How's it feel? Yeah, it's much love, man. I appreciate it. Uh, it feels good. Everything, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Now, I seen you doing, you know, you've been grinding for a minute with the rap shit, but, you know, about, I'm going to say a cool eight, nine months ago, Something real big happened. Um, you know, a real tragedy, you know, happened um in Houston, Texas. You don't I don't want you to get too detailed into it because I know, you know, we're still, you know, carried on and, and shit like that. But you know, the fans, you you have yet to speak about it. Um, and you don't have to be detailed and get too detailed on what happened. But you know, that day, you know, you getting shot in the head. Um, can you take us like what led up to that? Mm, nah, I, I, I mean, shit. It's like, nah. It's, I, I want to talk about this type shit. Okay, and I respect it. You know, I, I respect it. Um, because you know that was one of the things that that put you all over the blog sites and how a lot of people got you know introduced to your name. Um, you know, and, and that shit. Do you feel like that that kind of changed your outlook on you know life? Yeah, of course. Uh, generally, people look at me uh, like some sort of uh, rat star. You feel me? But, I mean, mm -hmm. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Now, I, I look on YouTube. You, you know, I see you got 5.5 million views, 2.6 million views. You know, you definitely doing your thing. Another 2.2 .2 million views, 1.5. You know, you definitely doing your thing. Was that kind of like, did that happen after... The shooting, or you kind of already had that buzz? Uh, I, I already had it. You hear me? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Now, that the day that it happened, um, you know, I, it was a lot of blogs that, that covered the story. Um, you know, you you were shooting a music video, and you you know, you know kind of told people the, the location or the DM for the location and stuff like that. Like, did you give it out to the masses, or was it just the fr your friends? Nah, it was just uh my friends, the group of people I wanted uh to be at the video type shit. You show up to the music video, the the video shoot, and are y'all just chilling or what? And see, it's not too much to talk about, you feel me? It's just Okay. See, we was at the okay. show and uh that you got shot, you feel me? That's it. Okay. Yeah. You know, I, I respect it. I, I don't want to, you know, keep digging into it. I know, you know, I just know the fans want to know when um, a lot of fans care about you. You know, a lot of a lot of, uh, you know, your fans been, you know, reaching out for this interview, you know, when you went ghost on Instagram for like, what, two, three months? Yeah. Yeah. You said it right. But shit, I, I appreciate all the, all the love and shit. I, I'm getting better. I will be back. You know what I'm saying? Cause, Cause, like I said, you know, a lot of the the fans, you know, you, you went ghost for a long time, and you know, I remember when you first your, your, when you made your first Instagram post returning, you know, back on Instagram, a lot of people were excited to see, you know, you bounce back as quickly, you know, as you did, because you know, a headshot, that shit ain't that shit ain't nothing to play with. Yeah, of course, hell and nah. you feel me, that shit, a nigga good. Are there are you are there things you're gonna do differently now that you're back? Have you learned anything from that? Yeah. My, what did you learn? My protection. I got to think these steps ahead of these things. So, with you getting shot in the head, did you have to go, have, you know, go through surgery? Oh, yeah. I had to learn how to do everything. You feel me? I had to learn how to talk. I had to learn how to walk. You feel me? She's just crazy. Man. That, that's unfortunate, man. But I'm I'm happy you still here today. Yeah, yeah, for sure, my son, man. For real, I appreciate you, you know, doing the interview, interview with me. All right. Do Do you remember, you know, exactly like that very moment, or is it's kind of like blank to you right now? Uh, is everything that happened is is blank to me. I I passed out. You feel me? So. 
Yeah. That's just crazy. So how often do you have to go to, to the doctor now? Uh, once a week. Therapy, that's it. Okay. It's just, well, that's it's good. You bouncing back, man. Yeah, once a day. Now, in that shooting, two other people got killed. I believe it was one of your friends and one of your cameramen. Um, yeah, R.I.P., man. How how close were you to these two people? Shit. I don't want to speak about it. Shit. Now, you know, with this rap shit, I've I've deal with a lot of rappers every day, man. I deal with the with the craziest rappers, the the I, I deal with all the rappers across the the globe and every hood. And it's like it seems like when rap creates petty beef, man, like it creates you know, a lot of a lot of people who beef in rap, they used to be real cool, but it's like a, a rap. People have egos and pride, and rap starts a, a lot of a, a lot of beef. You know what I'm saying? Do you feel like that has occurred in your life? Like rap has kind of it's it's a lot of good, but it brings a lot of bad too. Yeah, yeah, nah, it's just niggas envy. You feel me? Everybody, everybody want wanted to be some. You know what I'm saying? 